Oh man, big stuff popping. Hello my friends. Welcome. Welcome to Small City Adventures. We are talking gaming and this is a story that I've been gathering a little bit of information on. In the gaming world, we have three major consoles and two of them. Two of those being Sony's PlayStation and Microsoft's Xbox. Me personally, I own both of the systems and I enjoy it both of the systems i guess i would say that i use the playstation a little bit more both of them gather a lot of dust but i do use the playstation uh, a, a good bit more um so anyways a big story has been making headlines and for good reasons all right so you got the game call of duty which is a huge franchise really huge franchise like the money gets made um of being activision and i talk about it like it's almost just call of duty but it's activision activision has some other stuff that they have um so i mean it's more than this but call of duty is what i know activision for um i play call of duty seems to be a really 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 big game in the space and probably i would say the biggest when it comes to, uh, I wouldn't say, is it like the Battle Royale John Romos? And also, I, or they probably call it like a shooter. And then they have campaigns. But I think a lot of their stuff is mainly their online. Their multiplayer is really big. And Microsoft is pretty much trying to buy them up. You know, they got to go through all the legal stuff. Um, you know antitrust stuff with the government before the deal goes through but what they did was they have uh linked up with nintendo and um entered a deal where for i guess the next 10 years they'll be getting the call of duty titles on day you know day one i think of the release date so that's big that's big because we're looking at a big title okay we're looking at a huge title when we talk about call of duty a huge title activision that activision deal right so with this i think i don't know if they try to you know beat out sony well, i guess they would try that's their competitor but they are so this is a big thing because I believe they could swing some people to their platform um, if that happened. It would. I think it would. Don't know if it would be the greatness they think it will be. But yes, it does leave an opening. Now, play. I mean, Sony might can do something as far as, I don't know, building another franchise to combat that. But... Uh, as it stands now, I want to say 2024, one of those years, is the last year of the Activision Sony agreement. I believe I saw that. That's a legend. I don't know how thorough that news was, but that's what I'm seeing. So that is a big, big, big thing. Um, I know there's a war between the uh, PlayStation and Microsoft people, but uh, I... Uh, it, it, it's, it's definitely it's definitely heating up definitely heating up so we'll see what happens we will see what happens and other than that hope you're having a wonderful time here welcome to small city adventures if you haven't liked go ahead and like if you haven't subscribed go ahead and subscribe more news coming